Hello, my name is Creostix and welcome to Stasis. Uh, this was uh, without a family, man alone in the world trembles with the cold. Andre Mauroys. Right, this was a, a request from quite a long time ago. I bet you thought I'd forgotten, but I hadn't. Haha, <laughs> and uh, so that's why we're here. And I really don't know all that much about this I it's apparently the the brotherhood presents the little bit I do know is that it, it obviously has something to do with like space and I think it's an isometric view but that's about it Neptune like the planet or is or, or, or is, is it like a like a corporation or whatever well isn't Neptune a gas giant I I, I get my planets mixed up, it, it, but I think so. Like a pretty big one. The, it's the one that is farthest away, I think, since now, since Pluto is no longer a planet. What does that say? Lake something. Godum Lake or Bodum Lake or some, some something like this. Are you giving me names of, like, voice actors or what's with the... Hmm... Cool visuals, I th I feel so far. I'm not sure what I was expecting, but this is a, this seems more stasis. Yes, very very cool. This seems a little more um, cinematic than I expected. In a, like it's it's more movie like, like l l literally. So music by okay, uh, Mark Morgan, hmm. but. Uh, I don't recognize the name, but I'm not... Musicians are, 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 are not my strong suit. Uh, but, um... Yeah, so... Uh, a spaceship or a station floating above Neptune? Is 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 that the, the, the thing where... Hmm... It, the visual design looks really cool, I, I gotta say. I... I'm really impressed by this. I like what I what I'm seeing here. Really, really cool. My my vague memory suggests that Neptune is a blueish planet. I think so. The you know the dark blue background sort of does fit the bill if it is the the planet Neptune. So okay. Uh, ah, we have some tube. Is is that the Stasis tube. Ah, well, hello. Here, here we are then. I hope, I if I'm understanding correct correctly. So have we? And there we are. Okay. Nice landing. Very, very good. And hello. Good, good morning. Okay then, now. Welcome to the Gain Corporation Stasis Plug Suit. Stasis Plug Still while your biometric scans are completed. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, I guess I have no choice. What is Arthurinia? Multiple fractures along ribs three, five, eleven and fourteen. Extreme muscle atrophy. Danger of heart failure. Danger of pneumothorax. Seek immediate medical attention. Okay, uh... Medical data storage is damaged. Formatting quantum storage device. Plug suit quantum storage device is ready for physical record storage. Shush. A smeared pool of some dark, sticky, congealed substance. Okay. Uh, uh, r right. Uh, so... My, like, medical lingo is not my strong suit, but uh, pneumothorax. Isn't isn't thorax like the inside of the neck? And, you know, pneumonia, pneumo, like, does it mean like a inflammation of the thorax? Is that what we're talking about here? And lots of broken ribs and all that stuff. G good, great. And again, I don't, I don't know if that's what 
pneumothorax means, but that's what my logic sort of jumps into. I can move, but... This isn't my ship. If you say so, but I'll take your cryo tube. Inside the glass tube, a corpse hangs like a grotesque puppet, tangled in the pipes and wires that had once provided life. It is now no more than a lifeless husk. If we have a lot of flavor text, I'm probably not going to read all of it out loud, but uh, uh, humid steam gives, gives off a sickly sweet smell. Okay. Screens. The only sound in the room is the hiss of a static from the monitors. Their fl flickering light illuminates the leather chair. The cracks in its surface evident even beneath the shroud of dust that covers it. Okay, w we have dust, so it's been a while. The white paint has been flaking off for some time, exposing the rusted metal beneath. A red hologram floats silently in the air beside the door, pulsing to indicate the door is locked. Uh, okay, how do I, you know, like, what is the method of, like, telling, it's, but, but then again, <clears throat> it's kind of in, in, interesting to uh, get a, like a, I'm assuming a story-based game, since we have dialogue boxes and, and, and all that. John, okay, my name is John, uh, good. It's in, 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 in interesting to have like a, you know something like give me flavor text as the player. Like it's not super Im 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 immersive per se, but that doesn't really need to be always the case. Especially like if you have isometric things, that's that's fine. Subject: Maracek J, batch number. Da -da -da -da, cryostasis interrupted. Okay, so. Am I John Maracek? I'm gonna assume so until proven otherwise, I suppose. Okay. Where do I go? Uh, my, my heart. It's I'm. Sh Please seek immediate medical attention. From where? Oh, open door. Thank you. Question mark. Yeah, oh, I was wondering if I could still check the monitors, but let's just move on. Increased heart rate detected. Automated medical care systems are non-functional. Please seek medical attention. <laughs> right. Uh, is the... Is the... I already forgot the name of the corporation there, but okay. And yeah, it's like a sp spinning fan more uh, f f flavor text. Right, it shows that I came from there, okay. Alarm lights, lights pulsing. Okay, so... Again, I'm gonna assume that, that Neptune means, you know, the planet. So we're on Neptune, or uh, above ne Neptune. In a spaceship, that's not our spaceship. Uh, and... I can't quite make out the speak. I think no. However, blood stain. Dried blood streaks the floor in a wide swath, as if someone had been dragged or slowly crawled away. It's hard to tell whether it came from or went toward the infirmary door. I'm gonna have to assume it came, get, went into the door, because otherwise, like, where would the rest of the blood be and there's no body? I mean, it's not, you know, it's not a, a, an exact science, but, you know. Okay. Chair, chair. Ooh. Product check-in terminal. Sure. Check-in products. EA, can we play Minesweeper or something, or, or Solitaire? It's, it's, I, I hear it's a good way to pass the time. Product storage. Uh, sure, instead of medical attention, let's just see product sto st storage checklists. Uh, okay, well, let's, let, let, let's check what I'm assuming is me. Blood type O+, uh, gender male. 
age 38, stasis pod acquired, personal transport ship intercepted en route to Titan Station, Station Espenza, as in the Moon Titan, I'm assuming, on... Was Titan on Jupiter or Saturn? Crap, I... Mm, I should know this, it's... Oh boy. Ah, crap, it's... I think it's... Uh... Saturn? You, you're gonna correct me, and I'm guessing I get the 50, 50, 50 chance wrong there, but I'm gonna say Saturn on a... Just, just, I have this inkling, and it's probably wrong, so yes. One of three stasis pods, right. What the other ones? Uh, Peters, 46, male... Returning luxuries, transport, all hands lost. One of twelve. Huh. Mail 90 in Jackson. Escape pod from downed transport between Earth and Mars. One of four. And male 36, all male, uh, mining transport orbiting Titan again. Part of a long-term terraforming operation. You know what? Now, now I'm second-guessing myself. I was thinking of a different thing, 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 thing than a moon. Titan might not have even been a moon, really. Now you're really just, you know, Correcting me like on every, it, I'm sure it's a an an orb in space. Let's just say that crap. Ah, or maybe it's it's not even that. I'm my memory is a jumbled mess of whatever right now. Part of a long-term terraforming operation. One of seventeen stasis pods. Like from the top of my head, like remembering stuff of like space names is like hold on just a second. Reserved for Project Kitchen Knife. Uh -huh. Why? Is he gonna become the kitchen knife, or is he just gonna be, you know, used on uh, w w with a kitchen knife? Uh huh. Right. In addition to Dr. Essex, we are happy to welcome Sarah Salvatore, the new head nurse of product storage. It was a sad day when Nurse Daniels left us for greener pastures and she will be missed. Notice, as our cloning facility has been deemed too costly... Cloning facility, great. We are happy to note that product storage has now been upgraded to a level 6 facility. We are now the number one supplier of human specimens to the entire facility. Lovely. After the unfortunate incident in Product Storage 2, we will be undergoing regular upgrades and maintenance, starting with a new lockdown and security system. Thank you for your hard work and dedication. What is that? Uh, notice, two weeks ago, a false security lockdown occurred in Product Storages 2 and 3. Kane Corporation, right, Kane Corporation has terminated op operations on both floors until a cleanup crew can evaluate the situation. We regret to report that the 17 crew deaths and the expiration of 12 unopened products occurred due to the emergency venting procedures. Huh. False lockdown, 17 dead and 12 unopened products as in human clones? Or humans, as in, as is, dead. Yikes. That's a, that's a pretty, yeah. Lovely. Uh, so. The words holographic, holotron projector are embossed in metal on this piece of machinery. But the screen is smashed and it looks beyond repair, okay. Again, I'm not gonna read every flavor text because because it looks like this, there's gonna be a lot of them and, and and we'll be here all day or week or you know you know what I mean. It's just I'm I'm gonna try to you know this. Don't 
do that. I'm, I'm gonna try to discern like what is important and what is not. I might be wrong on those, but we'll see. Okay, uh, cribs, hospital beds, room dividers, so you know, hospital stuff. Yeah. Or, you know, infirmary stuff, but you know what I mean. Either or, either or, okay. That's an interesting way to put it, but okay. Loss of limbs. Uh, I think the warning is... Oh boy. Ne dotikasi lat... Or urtsak. It's hard to say for sure, but it... It looks Eastern European. Maybe, you know, Czech or Polish or... Such and so. Hard to say. Like my, you know, Slavic languages. I, I, they. I'm not good at good at uh, discerning be between them. That's not my forte. Uh, Dockmate scanner terminal, right? Mechanical ventilators, beds, uh, surgeon arms, but I can't like use any 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 of them. So. It doesn't really help me. Right, so do I, just, do, I, do, do I just go forward? What a weird... Oh, breaker box, right, I, I, I can do that. The hand symbol is like... <laughs> oh boy. Oh, it's like a puzzle, I th uh, okay. Uh, press button, nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Oh. Uh huh. Yay. Oh. What about this one? No. Okay, so let's just. Oh. So I can do like, uh,. Uh huh. Um. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So I can do two of them at, at a time. So do we want surgeon or scanner to see like? Do do we go to the surgeon immediately or scan first? What's what's completely wrong and then, uh, so. I. I vote to check what's wrong first. Uh, escape key? No. Ah, there you go. Yay! Let's scan ourselves. Medical di a a diagnosis to a non-invasive scanning procedure. Good to know. Treatment is administered through a nanite solution drug cocktail that is d delivered intravenously. Okay. <laughs> Good. Yay. Multiple injuries detected. You don't say. Emergency medical kit created. Good solution. Anticoagulant and morphine combination suggested. Huh. Thank you for using DocMate systems. Have a nice day. Mm -hmm. Emergency medical kit. Sure thing, Chief. Come now. Automatically filled with a required dosage of medication. Yay! So, go do win. Okay, so I have an inventory now. Uh, how do I use on... Uh-huh. So I have it, but I 
is is there like a ah you know c combine those and let's roll Deep breath. so you can just you know do that on your on on yourself that's handy you know hit hit, hit the oh bad. Sandy said that if you have bad dreams and you can't wake up that you'll be stuck in them forever well I'll have a good talk to Sandy's parents What's with true? Becca, don't worry, you won't have any dreams for the entire trip. But if you do, just squeeze Teddy, and I promise they'll go away. Now legs up, lay down. Uh-huh. There you go. Sweet dreams, my girl. No. Wait, sing it. Sing the song. There's like an auto tune on the ch like child's voice. Sing. Go to sleep. Uh -huh. Baby girl in your warm bed. Not creepy at all, no. Sing yes. Err. Uh. Don't know. Uh uh. No, 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 no. Yes, they can and don't do. Oh boy. I've never worried this much so far. Right, but it's still bad. No. Oh boy. Can we so drift away, sleepy head? Great. I, I was wondering about. You know, you could have just told her that we're going to have so many drugs in our system that we'll barely remember our own names. Uh, yeah. Somehow squeezing Teddy seemed a little more comforting than you'll be in a drug induced coma. Uh huh. We are almost done here. Do I get a Teddy? You, you get a hug. Uh-huh. Right. Uh Rebecca? Right, yeah. I my, my wife, my child. I need to find someone. I need to get out of here. Right. Okay, so collecting the thoughts here. Vital medical functions have been restored to benchmark levels. Great. Uh right, so uh a couple of thoughts. So, so yeah. So, so we're John, whatever the name was again, and we apparently went into cryo sleep, you know, stasis, whatever, uh, in our own ship with our wife and child, you know, th th three pods. So, so you know, uh, and then we woke up here. They're gone. We're super injured, uh, and judging from you know. What I mentioned of, of what I saw from the clone stuff, it's like, am I the original John whatever, or am I just a clone of John whatever? Hmm. Then again, they did say, uh, you know, pod 1 of 3 and pod 1 of 14 and such, so that would indicate the idea that I would be like, you know, taken from the ship. But, hmm. It's hard to say for sure yet. It's, 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 it's just guesswork, really. Do I still need the surgeon terminal, or I mean, at benchmark levels, you say so? Might as well check, I suppose. But I got a feeling I'll be fine now. But just just to check, let's just see what see what see what it does. Maybe I'll get superpowers by means of augmentation. Okay, access surgery logs. Uh, Saul. By Dr. Essel's cranial bone extraction for Sigma Labs notes last surgery completed before Spec Ops surgery lockdown. Product expired during surgery, but bone extraction was successful. Okay. 
Uh, the neural drill is stuck again. Every time I try, I try to change it, the arm retracts. Please get maintenance down to fix it. I'm sure they'll be right on that. Uh, high speed neural drill. Oh, it was a click thing. Right. Give me just a second. Back on, please. Uh huh. Um, I'm not sure I want to utilize any of those. Okay, do I want to put my face in, in a neural drill? Sure. Yeah, let's just do exactly that. What do you... Nothing. Okay, I think we're good. Uh, change the, uh, the power to... Uh, basic life support, I think, and just see what happens. Or, or, or at least, um, just, so, turn that off, and, and... Oh! Oh, sorry, no. I mean... I'm just assuming that it's a good thing to have on overall, but okay, so... Do we now go back to the red door, or what's with the deal there? Might as well check. Attention. Due to the threat of external contamination, a security lockdown is in order. Please meet at your closest administration office for further instructions. Mm hmm. I think you'll find that there's not much of an administration uh, around at this point. I, I just feel that there's a, w a way to go, I suppose. Yes, okay, good. Is anyone there? Apparently no answer, at least, and more possibly bloodstains? It's kind of weird how the, uh, like, I can't move the screen. It's, it's just s s static screens, but okay, okay. Huh. Heavy loader brings back mem m memories of alien in in a, in, a, in, a, in a weird way. Elevator is locked, so information general. Let's yes, give me every information. Yes. Security lockdown. What was that? Why there's nobody here? Maybe they were evacuated or killed. Hard. Oh, I can't like get any. Fine. I heard a, a growl of, of, of like a dead space beast or something. I don't like it. New. No. Empty. Well. Fuck. I just. Language. The hell is everyone? Il I'm. I'm. Great. Good. I picked it. Okay, what's with the with the background noise? Like really, jeez. Ah. Okay, now. Let's see what the admin computer says. Administration terminal. Robert Flee freely. Oh boy, security systems. Uh, lots of text. I. That's a lot of reading, man. Uh, like, yeah, like it, it, like this much reading, I'm not gonna do on like. Uh, and what's with this? You're hearing that too, yes. <laughs> At least, like vaguely. Um, okay. Can I unlock anything? Notice. Maintenance doors unlocked. Lock will be engaged in three hours. Okay then. We have an unlocked door and I can't do anything else about these things. Great. That's like, yeah, if, if it's like, like that many, you know, 
emails or whatever. That's that's we're gonna be here all all week. Can't can't read everything, or I shouldn't. I think I hope. Yukka Cola. <laughs> Yukka is a very uh, common Finnish uh, f first name, so good for that. But uh, with this little intro, I'm all out of time now for this episode, and uh, I do hope you've enjoyed this. I'm curious. This is an interesting, a very different one that I've been playing so far on the channel. So, huh? And it seems pretty pretty unique so far, like an almost horror-y sci-fi space thing. Are there enemies? I don't know. We'll see. But, uh, yeah. And if you have enjoyed this, please do drop a like or a comment or even subscribe or share if you want to. It would really, really help. And follow me on Twitter if uh, if you want to. It's at Creosticks. Uh, yeah, I thank you so much for watching and I will see you again next time.